Hey fam, welcome to Jack to Jeep. It is Wednesday. I do apologize I didn't put a video out yesterday because we had a hell of a hailstorm last night and uh, it started pounding in here. It just sounded like I was in a bass drum and getting the, beat, the crap beat out of me. So made a little bit of an early light night last night. Didn't get a lot done. Um, Wednesday, Wednesday, I've been working all day in here for the most part. Kind of got it done as far as the paint goes. I'm letting it dry. Then I have to marker it. That way it looks more like a comic book, kind of. Um, I don't know. I don't know if this is going to work the way I did the paint. But I'm going to try. Yeah, I don't know. Let me flip the camera again so I can see what you guys are looking at here. So you can tell there's some white in it, some light blue, dark blue, metallic. Now, once this is all dry, I'm going to go back over the whole thing, lightly sand it all. So you can kind of tell my thought process on this. Let me back up here and zoom out. There you go. Kinda, then I did the top white. I will scrape around this window to clean that window off. I'm not worried about that a bit. Um, I still have to do the roll cage. I still have to put my window frame in, put the battery in, hook up all the lights, a lot of other stuff to do. Nonetheless, it's getting there. I can't put the hood down yet because these are still a little wet. And like I said, I'm gonna go over it one time, lightly hand sand it. And then what I'm doing, let me show you what I'm covering this with real quick. I have probably seven cans of this. It is clear, durable top coat, dead flat. So what I'm hoping is any of this shine, any of that crap will be taken out of it by the sand and by using this. So that's kind of my goal. Then I bought because this is really crappy here around this sharp edge. Let me find that piece and show you real quick. So I bought this channel, it grips, and I'll show you what it's gonna look like once I put it in there. Sorry about my amazing videoing. So it's gonna go around all the way. Now this one's loosey-goosey because I already took it off it wasn't quite the right size but it'll it's gonna again go all the way around it kind of finish off this rough edge around these lights the other thing i did is i got some where the heck did i put it right here i got some d channel i call it d channel because well it looks like a d 3m tape on one side and it goes up the sides of my hood that way when it sits on the fender it's not gonna be rattling and i'm not sure i gotta figure out how i can adjust this to where it'll close properly i think i have to loosen everything and then kind of get everything where it should be then tighten it up slowly so next process is getting this all tidied up getting the battery in start working on those other things i have yet to touch the bed of the jeep probably get that next um i want to give this paint job i'll probably end up not touching the paint not clear coating nothing until friday afternoon i'm gonna let it set all day tomorrow and half the day friday i was supposed to take this into the shop friday i thought it was tomorrow but it was friday i changed it i'm gonna take it in next week that'll give the paint ample amount of time to uh to dry so in the meantime, I'm just kind of letting everything dry, letting everything happen. If you want to see the finished product, you know the deal. Click subscribe, hit that bell. That way you can be notified of any new content. Hey, I do appreciate you guys watching, taking your time out just to visit my channel. Um, I posted on Instagram and TikTok that the last month I had, I think it said uh, eight new subscribers. You know, eight is more than none. So I do appreciate that immensely. And, uh, summer. You guys enjoy it. Get out, have fun, leave it better than you found it. Later.